Hey class of 2020, it's Major General Torch Williams, U.S. Forces Korea Chief of Staff and a member of the class of 89. And I'm the one who had the honor of swearing you in as cadets on July 1st, 2016, when I was your commandant. You know, on that day out on the Tizo grounds, you stood together for the first time as a class and you shouted, target in sight. I watched with pride as you developed as four degrees and my last USAFA event before leaving for my next assignment in Pacific Air Forces was your recognition. And let me tell you, you killed it. You made us all proud. The bonds you formed at USAFA will last a lifetime. The journey you've traveled as a group and individually has shaped you, and through each challenge, you've grown stronger. I couldn't be prouder of how you've endeavored to persevere. And I want to take this time to thank you because your ability to accept and adjust to your unique situation has been an example to our entire alumni community and drawn us closer together in support of you and our academy. The entire class of 2020 has a special place in the hearts of the entire Blue Line as evidenced by this group of characters with me today. Congratulations on persevering through the USAFA journey. And it's now time to drop bombs on that target that you've had your sights set on since July 1st, 2016. This part of your journey is coming to a close. And as you begin your next journey, it's time to set your eyes on a new target, the Operational Air Force. The next journey will have just as many twists and turns as your academy journey, but you're gonna go through it without Mitch's and two to a room, so I hope you learned how to cook. This group of old grads are proud to stand here today and say congratulations on your commissioning and graduation. Welcome to the Long Blue Line, and we hope to serve with you soon. Class of 2020, Target, Target in sight. Dismissed.